Hello everybody and welcome to I Scrap Happy Video. I'm here guys to share with you my project for the I Am Roses challenge for the month of February and um, I made a layout and uh, I did something different this time. Typically I don't um, create my own sketches before I create a layout. I just go with the flow and you know whatever happens happens. Um, but this time I decided to sketch something out just to see you know how I'd want it to be. <laughs> so this looks kind of crazy, but you know, it worked for me. I did, you know, decide on what I wanted to do based on this sketch. So in this video, I'm going to show you guys how I put together um, a layout um, based on this sketch that I created. All right, so the paper that I'm using is by Key and Company. And it is the Valentine collection that I picked up in Michaels. And I'm not going to flip through it because I don't want to make this video um, a long one. So let's get to it. So the first thing I did was I got my base paper. Um, and this is a basil cardstock. Don't remember. It's a textured one. Don't remember what the um, name of the color is. Um, but that is the first um, part of my layout. Um, what I did next was I selected my paper from the collection and I decided to go with this heart paper. And um, the next thing I did was I um, did a punch around the page um, with my Martha Stewart. Um, it's called the Flower Punch Large. So I already put back the edge one, but this is the corner. So this is what it looks like. And I just did that around an entire sheet of 12 by 12 paper. So uh, first things first, I'm going to go ahead and adhere this to the base of my, um, of my layout. And I'm just using my ATG and I'm just going to roll it along here like that. I mean, I probably should have used some, um, another adhesive, but I think this should be good enough for now. And I'm just going to go ahead and eyeball this and lay it out where it should be. Pressing it down once it's in place where I want it to be. And all right, I think that's it. All right, so that's the first step. Um, as you can see from the Sketch. I do have a heart, a big heart in the background, and what I did was I took a 12 by 12 sheet of pink cardstock and I used my Cricut Imagine. I hit fit to page and I cut out this heart. Don't remember exactly what size it turned out to be, but this is the um, this is how it fits on the page. So I'm going to go ahead and adhere that, and I'm only going to do like the center of the heart because I may want to stick things underneath it. So I'm um, not going to stick everywhere down all at once. Alright, so I'm just going to eyeball that, line it up, and stick it down once it's where I want it to be. Okay. Um, next on my layout, I part of the challenge, you have to include hearts in your layout. So... I picked this up in Michaels. This is the um, Cards and Envelopes by Can Company. And I believe it goes along with the same um, the paper pad that I just showed you. Alright, so I'm gonna be using one of the cards on my lay one of the cards on my layout, the card front on my layout, and I'm also gonna be using one of the envelopes. Because I'm gonna journal and um, insert something into the envelope. Um, also on my sketch, you'll notice that I drew out a doily that I want going around that area. So with my Cherry Lynn die, I used the Heartland America um, Cherry Lynn die to cut out this heart doily. And I'm actually going to insert that back here. And it also comes when you cut it out with the little pieces that go in here. And I'm actually going to reattach those. I don't want them to be separate from the heart. So I'm going to be inserting those here. Like that. 
that. So I'm going to pause the camera here, get this all glued down, and be right back. Okay guys, I'm back with the final project. This is my layout for the February um, I Am Roses challenge. Um, I created a 12 by 12 layout and you guys have seen me put it together. Um, I just wanted to come on here and share the final product. So um, the title is Love Is, and I went ahead and even though I, I absolutely do not like my handwriting, I decided to make it more personal and you know, just use my handwriting anyway. <laughs> Um, so it says, love is never forgetting to say the words, and then I love you, down here. So that is my little play on words here. And um, like I said, I added in a photo of my two boys. And as pink as this layout is, yes, it's not, you know, your typical boy layout. But this is about love, so I figured, you know, it's fine to go ahead and use pink and red and all the little girly things that I like because it's about love. And I love pink. <laughs> um, so this is how the layout turned out. And I'll show you guys all the little intricate details. The bling here. I really love this um, die cut by Cherry Lynn. And um, this is from that Can Company pack. I started to write the words, um, never forgetting to say the words here. Um, but I didn't like the way it turned out. So I added a flower there to cover up my little error. <laughs> Uh, or my little boo-boo. Um, and over here I decided to add in some leaves. So I added two leaves there. And I'll zoom in a little bit so you guys can see the details there. And the flower. This is also a die cut piece from that same Cherry Lynn die. And then here um, on the inside of the envelope I did go ahead and pull in some more blue. And it's just going to be a journaling spot for me. I'm going to go ahead and journal a little bit more about, you know, my love for my boys. Um, so that's that. And um, so that's my layout, guys. Hopefully you guys will play along and join us in the challenge this month um, to create your own little project. It doesn't have to be a layout. It could be a card. It could be whatever you'd like. You just have to use... Um, hearts and I think pink was one of the requirements and love is um, so go ahead and um, upload your videos or do a blog post um, and tie it back to the I am roses site and I'll have a link down below to that um, so you can participate in this month's challenge okay guys so that's it for me thank you all for tuning in to another I am roses video